looks like it might well be in the foot of Cheval Wilson. Oh, what a cracker. And it's taken Crystal Palace just four minutes. And they're in front. And that's a quite brilliant free kick from Siobhan Wilson. Signed last January for Malaga. The execution is excellent. No chance for Quantra. And the days are behind already. Their way forward, B. Johnson. It's a corner. The header was just the wrong side of the post. Mr. Thomas. It's a it. shot that takes a deflection. It was from Baptiste. Baptiste again, great strong running, and it's just the wrong side of the post. Free kick, Call Jade Haynes. Oh, right in the top corner. Crystal Palace are pulling the free kicks out of the top drawer this afternoon. That is sensational. Jade Haynes. The summer signing from Spurs will of course play here at the Hive. She's on the score sheet. The Palace are tuning up. Plays a good possession football, but that cross is easy for Chloe Morgan. Low Gambit. It's a cross in from the right hand side. Run away by Johnson. Eventually, Palace get it clear. The kick is a long way out, straight into the wall. Shot is on for Gamby. Of course, partially cleared. Eventually it is cleared. By Georgia Roberts and then the shot from distance. It's gathered by Pontra. Yes. Left hand side cuts inside. There's a go. And attention from Chloe Morgan. Into the back post. Mr. Pellis are absorbing a bit of pressure here. That's a decent hit. It dips just over the top with that Palace crossbar. That's a lovely ball. And away goes Bianca Baptiste. Who cuts back inside and Bianca Baptiste lifts home Crystal Palace's third. An early goal in the second half has surely sealed all three points now for Crystal Palace. It's a great finish out of the reach of Quantrill. It's taken them just 35 seconds in the second half to find the net. Cross and the header for Pickett. Drive is wide. Searching cross into the box and Pickett's header is saved by Morgan. Forward to it's another save by Morgan. Crystal Palace corner. It's whipped in ferociously underneath the crossbar. It's away by Georgia Roberts. Teha. It's another save from Chloe Morgan. And these are three goals behind here, but it's certainly created chances. Perhaps deserve better. Phyllis takes a deflection. Oh, that's a foul. And it's a penalty. A clumsy challenge by Hayley West. Coral Jade Haynes makes it 4 0 from the spot. A confident penalty dispatched past Sarah Quantrill. And Crystal Palace extend their lead to 4 0.
good shot from distance, dipping over the crossbar. They deserve a goal, London base. But that's a safe pair of hands from Chloe Morgan. Corner taken short. Too low, and there's a little tap in. They've got one back with five minutes to go, Melissa Finnis. It's a mere consolation, but it's no more than they deserve for the part that they've played in this game. It's been a tough afternoon again for the Bees, but they'll take plenty of encouragement from the performance. They won't want to go further behind. And it's a good save by Quantrup. 